Top 5 Best Android Smartwatches Number 5. Fitbit vs. 3 Smartwatch Fitbit made a name for itself with simpler fitness trackers, but the Versa 3 is a pretty lovely smartwatch in its own right. It has excellent battery life, up to 6 days when you're not using the AOD. Its Google Assistant integration is even better than what you get on Wear OS 2, with snappier, more reliable performance. The worst thing about the watch is a bizarre bug that makes changing watch faces a pain. Its MSRP is $230 but it's frequently available for less than $200 lately. If you like the look but want additional features, look into the Fitbit Sense. It's pricier, but it has a stainless steel case and extra health monitoring tricks. Pros, Marathon Battery Life. Robust Health Tracking. Understated, Handsome Design. Cons, Software Sometimes Buggy. Some health info is hard to find in the Fitbit app. Offline music storage only allowed with Deezer or Pandora. Coming in number 4. TicWatch Pro 3 Ultra GPS. The TicWatch Pro 3 was king of the Wear OS hill for a spell, so it's not much surprise that the updated TicWatch Pro 3 Ultra GPS is also quite good. There aren't actually many differences between the two watches, the new Ultra GPS has a refined design, slightly beefier wear 4100 plus chipset, and, according to Mavoy, meets the MALS TDA 10G durability standard. It's got outstanding battery life that'll easily last you more than a total of 24 hours, partially thanks to a unique dual-layer display that can enter a super low-power mode when you're not actively using the watch. Where OS 3 is scheduled to land on the Pro 3 Ultra GPS sometime this year, which will make the watch all the better. The Pro 3 Ultra GPS has an MSRP of $300, but you can pick one up for less if you keep an eye out for sales. Pros solid performance thanks to the 4100 Plus. Interesting and useful dual display to conserve battery in a pinch. All the sensors anyone will ever need. Cons Not yet on Wear OS 3. Bulky may not appeal to those with small wrists. Haptics feel weak. Coming in number 3. Mobvoi TicWatch E3. With Qualcomm's Wear 4100 chip, a whole gig of RAM, and a promised update to the new and improved Wear OS 3 sometime this year, Mobvoi's TicWatch E3 offers a lot of value for a relatively modest $200. Mobvoi went with a lower-cost LCD display to hit that low price, which means lower contrast and no perfect OLED blacks. Still, even with that less efficient display type, battery life stretches well into a second day. An essential mode also limits the watch's functionality but boosts battery life significantly. The E3 is still relatively new, but at an MSRP of $200, you can bet there'll eventually be some juicy sales on this one. Once it gets Wear OS 3, it'll be a great way to experience modern Wear OS on the cheap, and for the price, it's a good pick in the meantime, too. Pros, where 4100 chipset is snappy. Two full days on a charge, even with the always-on display on. In line to get Wear OS 3. Cons, thicker than we'd like. Setup is a pain. LCD display where many smartwatches have old. Coming in number 2. Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 Classic. The Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 Classic is a nice-to-have upgrade to the standard Watch 4. Functionality and performance are exactly the same across models, but the pricier Classics case is made of stainless steel instead of aluminum. The Classic also has a rotating bezel that can be used to make menu selections, scroll through notifications, and more. At an MSRP of $350, it might not an easy sell over the $250 base model watch for, but if you crave a more traditional-looking smartwatch or just can't live without that clicky bezel, the Classics Premium will be worth it for you. Pros, fast performance. Crisp, vibrant display. Rotating bezel is a treat. Cons, underwhelming battery life on the 42mm model. No Google Assistant. Requires some Samsung phone apps. Coming in number 1. Samsung Galaxy Watch 4. We're almost getting tired of saying it at this point, but the fact remains, if you want a smartwatch to use with your Android phone right now, Samsung's Galaxy Watch 4 should be at the top of your shortlist. Not only does the Watch 4 family still enjoy exclusive access to Wear OS 3, but it's also an excellent smartwatch besides. 
Performance out of its Exynos W920 chipset is top-notch, its 60Hz display is bright and vibrant, and battery life is above average. The 40mm model offers 30 or so hours between charges, the larger 42mm model goes closer to 40. The Galaxy Watch 4 does require some Samsung apps on your phone to get the fullest experience, you won't be able to see your SPO2 stats without Samsung Health, for example, but with excellent performance, a tremendous 60Hz display, and, along with the Watch 4 Classic, or OS 3 exclusivity, it's the easiest wearable to recommend to most Android users right now. Google Assistant has also finally arrived on the Watch 4 series, meaning we can finally take advantage of Google's voice prowess for commands rather than being limited to Bixby alone. Just be warned, Assistant can take the Watch 4's battery from above average to med without much effort. Pro's display is crisp, bright, not particularly flickery. Where OS offers great software support. Build quality is great. Cons, default strap can be uncomfortable. Battery life could be better, charging could be faster. Mandatory Samsung stuff.